kitty. Right. You guys heard a cat too, right? I got the sense Edie had spent a lot of time here. Where is the cat outside? Oh yeah. This will be obvious later, but my mom never told me any of these stories. Edie would have, but mom didn't like bringing up the past. Though, when we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. Hmm. What the heck is up with this bird? Oh, I can't look in that peephole. All right. Her room was like a museum. Odin. For 500 years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune and misfortune. Real news from around the world. How do I control this? Wait, no. I want to look. I just don't know what to do. Oh, probably hit the trigger, huh? Odin Finch buries the latest victims of the family curse. His wife, Ingeborg, and their newborn son, Johan. On January 7th, 1937, he set sail with his family and his house, hoping to leave the curse behind. Shouldn't you leave the house if you want the curse to stick? Never mind. But 40-foot waves off the coast of Washington send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. Odin's daughter Edie, with husband Sven and baby Molly, step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. What am I seeing in between? There's an old lady there. See that? Right there? The heck? His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. That's creepy. Is that Edith Finch? Ugh. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. So I'm going to find out about everyone in this book, huh? The whole family tree? Is that what this game is? All right. This game was designed by Ancestry.com. Wow. Lewis died a week before we left, but Edie had already started to memorialize him. Edie knit me a new pair of gloves every year, just in time to replace the old ones. Okay, that's where I came in, right? Edie gave a big interview about a mole man living under the Finch house. My mom was furious. <laughs> the world. I hadn't thought of myself as Edith Jr. for a long, long time. Good job, Sven. Edie told people Sven was killed by a dragon. She could also have said he was building a dragon-shaped slide that collapsed. She mm. could, but she didn't. Alrighty. I think we've seen that before, huh? Anything else in here before we... Even in her 90s, sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. Whoa. Yeah. The only trace Grandpa Sam's first wife Kay left on the house was the pink bathroom. Yikes. 
There's probably so much. It was a pretty big trace. <laughs> Wet mold on that floor. Oh yeah, that's sealed shut. This is a door, right? Is that sealed as well? I guess we're going back out the window. Alrighty. Interesting. I don't know how to get out the window. I'm pushing the trigger. Whoop. That's so weird that the Y button pulled up the menu, not the start button. Okay, obviously... There's something I didn't trigger yet, because it's not letting me leave. Probably having tunnel vision again, where as I play the game, I don't see it. But as I watch back, I'm like, dude, it's right there. It's so obvious. Ah, oh, here we go. One summer, they evacuated the island, but Edie refused to go for a few weeks. She was a celebrity. A little forest fire. Oh, still sealed up, huh? Okay, was that it, maybe? Can I go out now? Hmm. I find it hard to believe there's nothing here to interact with. I feel like I saw an origami shark, but I'm not uh, going to look again to make sure. Also, I'm deathly afraid of sharks. Well, I feel like I'm stuck in this room. And that cable, of course, leads to the TV. Where do you push the left trigger and it zooms in? I cannot, for the life of me, figure out how to get out of here. Aha! Here's something. Hmm. There's a secret in this bathroom. It's in the last place you would look. It isn't in the cupboard. It's hidden in this book. What? 